The first thing we need to do is go up here to Tools on the menu bar. And click that once. And then we go down here to this entry called Set Living. And I'm going to click that. We get this little dialog box that allows us to tell Roots Magic whether we're going to want to toggle this living flag on or off, true or false, respectively. And in this case, we're going to leave it selected to false. If yours is true, just change it to false by clicking here and setting it where you want it to be. And then right here on this OK button, we'll click that. Now what we need to do is mark people who meet two conditions. The first is that their living flag is set to true, and the second is that they were born more than a certain number of years ago. In this example, I'm going to choose 120. So we'll go up here to Mark Group button, and I'll click that. And then I'm going to select this entry right here, Select People by Data Fields. Now you might think that you want to go down here and select the Living button, but if you do that, that simply allows you to select to mark people by whether their living flag is, is true or false. That's not what we want. We want that second date field to be in there. So we're going to select this one, select date people by data fields. And the first field I want to set is the living flag. So I'm going to scroll down here to that and click living flag. And I want this to say living flag is true. And then the next field that I want to search on is birth. So I'm going to go down here and select birth. And the date is selected automatically. And then I want this to change from equals to is before. And it's 2010 right now, so I'm going to set this to uh, if the birth is before 1890 and the living flag is true, then I want those people marked. So I'll just click OK here. And it's marked 537 people in this sample file that I have. So I'm going to click OK. And you can see, if we scroll down through here, we've got quite a few people who were born before 1890 whose living flag is set. So I want to commit mass murder on these records. So I'm just going to go down here and click OK. And all of those living flags have now been changed to false. And we can verify that by running the same process again. So we'll go to Tools, Set Living, Accept the False setting, and click Mark Group. Select People by Data Fields. Now our, our same settings are there. This is preserved between markings and searches. So we're just going to click OK and we should get zero marked people, which is exactly what we got. So all of those living flags were changed to false, so now our data is cleaner.